That's a smashing thing, that. Where would you get a thing like that? Mary Hill Shop Centre. Oh, hi. Uh, smashing. Hi, smashing. Welcome back to It's a Vase Productions, where today I'm watching my new favorite show, Still Game. I think you've heard of it. You keep telling me to watch it, and I'm going to keep watching it. Uh, when I put the last episode out, uh, people in the comments were like, there were several different people who were like, the next episode is just amazing. And it seems like every episode is amazing. Fight! Your part! Stick your pub up your ass! Oh. Long for indefinitely. What have you still to do? Uh, I'll have to get a key cut. Two bolts for the hall, being it not screwing. I need a battery for that doorbell. Uh, bolt of underline, couple of dusters, a belt for the Hoover. Right. PTO. Wait a minute. Get a pint. Right. What's those things that we did first? It's the name of this shop again. <laughs> hey, I don't know. Barrio themes or something. <laughs> Shy hole. <laughs> there you are, gentlemen. Top of the morning and the look of the Irish. Ah, that's smashing. What to uh, part of Ireland are you from? Springbank. <laughs> What's in the bag? Hey, old Clay's. The charity shop. I hope that big honey's on the day. Hard with the tips. Hey, hey, hey. What? Not that, the tits. All right, old gentleman Jack. You coming in? No, I'll wait here. What's the matter with you? You have tits? Shut up. I'll stand here and I'll smoke my pipe. Get in, are you daft? <whistles> Hello, my darling. You remember us? Eh, uh, I think so. The two debonair patter merchants for Craig Bank? Yes, how could I forget? So, what would you like to give me? Oh, a night on the town, cosy meal, bottle of wine, dancing till two. A meal of wine and then dancing. No, I meant in the bag. That's the mystery, eh, sweetheart? Old clays. <laughs> Excuse us. What's the score with you? What? Where's the old silver tongue, eh? I'm knocking him up and you're sleeping. Old clays. Where's the banter? The old double act. Can he be asked? Leave her alone. Leave her alone. Fancy her. I do not. Aye, you do. You've even taken a beamer. I haven't. It. It's just. It's too warm in here. Why don't you ask her out? She's lovely. Don't be ridiculous, Victor. There's nothing ridiculous about it, Jack. Just ask her out for a wee meal or something. You think? Aye. Forgive me, sweetheart. We don't even know your name. It's Barbara. Barbara. Lovely. My friend here has something he'd like to ask you. Oh? Jack anywhere? Aye. You flew by here two minutes ago without so much as a buy your leave. Right. What are you doing? Oh, sorry. This is Chris, Tomo, <laughs> Gilly, Kylie, Pat and Tiffany. As you can see, Pat and Tiffany are an item. <laughs> what the hell are you playing at? I come barred out the clansman. I've nowhere else to go. So you're hanging about with these mutants? <laughs> you just get a drink in the house. I'm not drinking in the house in my Todd. It's the company I'm missing. Sitting there with Jackie Bird staring at you as if you're an alky. Here, have you tried this? Skadooba. 6%. Strawberry. <laughs> Barbados in a bottle. What the hell did Bobby oh, buy you for? Dude, those well, drinks. it was something over nothing, really. I mean, I went in there and I said, Afternoon, Bobby. Pint of my usual, please. So he gives it to me, but it seems a tad cloudy. So I suggested that maybe he rinse out his pipes, you know, but Bobby said it wasn't the pipes. So I merely suggested that I be furnished with a fresh pint. But for some reason, Bobby escorted me for the premises. Why don't you just get a pint in Bruins? Bruins? 
I'm not going to Bruins. The last time we were in there, somebody got stabbed. Bruins is full of roasters. <laughs> it was 15 years ago, for God's sake. <laughs> no chance. Bruins is a toilet. Got a Gillies with us for the game of Gran Turismo? Right. Maybe I could oh, have a pint in Bruins right enough. <laughs> now that I didn't understand. <laughs> The door was open there. What the hell happened to you? Ah, well, didn't give a very good impression, did I? Oh, no, he gave a very good impression, Jack. Of Jesse Owen. <laughs> right at the shop and said, look at your bus. Ah, well, bottle crashed. I'm past asking MD out. Let's see. Oh, we've got here. <laughs> what? Was a rare day of that, eh? Uh, What's the name of that big dame there? Well, that's Janet Freel. That was the spinster that lived up the stairs. Sure, mm. aye, aye, aye. Janet Freel. Butter wouldn't he melt, eh, Jack? Aye. Did she not get pumped in the lobby that day? <laughs> That's right, I was once this way that I had up the old bastard. <laughs> How long's Jean away now, Jack? Hmm, about two weeks it'll be. Ten years. Ten years? That means my Betty's away twelve years. Aye. It's all racing away for us now, eh? Uh, that's uh, kind of a bother, but I'm not, I'm not going through on that again. You know, Jack, it's, it's not my place to, to tell you how long a man should mourn, but... Ten years... Ten years is plenty. Uh, going on a date doesn't betray Jean's memory. She'd want you to be happy. Why don't you get doing that shop? Ask that woman out, eh? Besides, hey, diddies. <laughs> <laughs> No used to be Bruins. That's right, sir. Changed hands years ago. All oh, right. So what can I do for you, sir? Paint a lager, please. Geez, it must be 15 years since I was in here last. Really? That's one pound thirty. Eh? One thirty. Geez, oh look at that. Nice clean paint, eh? This is a smashing shop you've got, son. Thanks very much. Free Bobo Mitchell. See you in another 15 years. <laughs> Listen, mate, uh, you mind very much if I can myself. Yeah, I want you go and you. Wait a minute. What are you going to say? Hey, I'm going to say. Hello, Barbara. It's me, Jack. Uh, nice to see you again. Uh, allow me to be straight with you, Barbara. Uh, I've admired you for a long time uh, from afar. And it occurred to me. Well, you and I are about the same age, and uh, I wondered if you were free to do so, would you like to accompany me uh, to maybe a movie show, or for a meal, or simply a drink? What do you say, Barbara? That's lovely, Jack. Yeah. Hello. Go out. That would be lovely. When? Uh, Thursday. Oh, Thursday. I generally go out on Thursdays with my sister. Oh. Wait, what about your pal? The four of us could go out. Aye. Uh, uh, just a minute. <laughs> Hello. 
How'd you get on? How did we get on? She said I, and she's got a sister. Not what happens. They're not coming. They've given us a dussy. Relax. They'll be here. And with that bus, will be bloody late. Ah, and with that stupid bastard that drives it two miles an hour because he's blind. <laughs> Here we go. Right. <laughs> you nervous? Nervous? I am nervous. I have a right to be nervous, you know. I haven't a clue what this sister looks like. Hello, Jack. Hello, Victor. This is my sister. Oh, he did. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, buddy. Two pints, Sam. There's the uh, guy. Who's the other one for? Me. Oh, what did Ruth go with me? Oh, I'm mad with a thirst. A sandal. An Arab sandal, I. I'm dry. Bone dry. Mm. <laughs> well, a ball didn't change that, Bobby, is it? Right here, Winston, quick! They'll get me bloody bad as well. Oh, here, cheers, that's smashing. What do you know just going and apologise to him first? Ah, oh, he can whistle for it. I'm no apologising. I'm fine out here. Here, when you go back in there, tell Big Arthur he's sitting his arse and I can see the fit boy, no? <laughs> Hello, lads. Hi, Winston. Oh, hello, ladies. I'm Winston. Oh, hello, Winston. <laughs> you still born? Hi. Here, which one of you two unlucky bastards is saddled with a munchkin? Right, that's it. Where are you going? <laughs> hey, I'm not sitting in my local with that thing, Jack. Oh, well, that's just perfect, isn't it? You're going here while they're leaving me with these two women. I only saw one woman, Jack. I don't know what that other one is. A munchkin, sure. Shut up. <laughs> Come on, Victor, get a chance. Feel me out here. That's <laughs> right. You owe me. Aye, aye, aye. You want anything brought out? Aye, bag of nuts. Bag of nuts, right. Big bag or a wee bag? Wee bag. Just like Victor's. <laughs> Victor? Jack? What are you staying in at this time? Well, we're out with a couple of friends if it was any of your bloody business. I'm better way while I'm at it. When are you letting Winston back in? When he apologises. Hmm. Aren't you uh, going to introduce me? No, certainly. Barbara. Hello. Hello, Barbara. And Edith. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> hey, hey, he's for. Hey, well, we'll have our usual. Uh, have a... Gin and tonic, please. Edith. Fine again, is. <laughs> Sam, Arthur, right. What's the score? Two one, Chelsea. Are you apologising? Where's your apology, you prick? You're still barred. Oh, is this yes. your local then? Oh, aye, myself and Victor have been coming here long and weary, aye. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, uh, Edith, so do you work in the shop with, uh, with Barbara? No. So. 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 I do alterations and that. So when... Six pound eight. Well, you might want to have a word with Bobby and alter his prices, either. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying that we just do the alterations and that. You might want to alter the prices in here. Oh, good you
Gundy, 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 in the windy box. That's. Oh, oh my goodness. There's your bus now, isn't it? Listen, that was lovely, Jack. Oh, I had a lovely time. I must say, Barbara, he's a good company, right enough. Huh? I'm just saying, Victor, good company. Aye, good company. Right. See you soon, then, Jack. Oh. <laughs> So, what's your next move? Look, I don't know. If she gives me a phone, I'll, uh, I'll take it for her, you know. Will you be seeing me? No! Uh, <laughs> uh, Victor. Hi, Jack. It's Sunday morning. Let's fatten up the ducks. Eh, uh, I can't. What are you talking about? Sunday, it's park day. Morning. Well, actually, I'm I'm going to do the park with Barbara. All right. So, eh. Uh... See you after. I enjoy yourself. <laughs> Just the one big Kit Kat. Aye, what of it? Ah, do you normally get two big Kit Kat? One for you, one for Jack? <laughs> we didn't do everything together, Navid. We only joined at the hip. Oh, Bellut, eh? Bad news. Ah, do you can you afford to be falling out with your pals at your age? And why would that be, Trisha? <laughs> well, you're an old man. You could die in the night, and then you and Jack would be in separate worlds with unfinished business. £2.20. <laughs> Jeez, uh, hello. Hello, Isa. He's a wee pal the day. Think they fell out. Oh. Well, haven't they fallen out? Lucky donkey, Navid. Oh, aye, I'll have a lucky donkey, no, Navid. You'll be a bit of a loose end with Jack tripping the light fantastic with that Barbara sort. No, Isa, good luck to them. Two donkeys. <laughs> Victor, I've got something to tell you. What is it, Isa? This Barbara. Well, she's... Let me guess. She's the Black Widow. No, no, she's... Junkie. She's a lap dancer, <laughs> working at a bad club in the toon, firing ping-pong balls right out the duff. <laughs> That's a crack. Out the duff. <laughs> pong, pong, pong. <laughs> well, you know I don't like gossip. How you day? <laughs> I was at the doctor's this morning. Women's troubles. Oh, yes. And who else is sitting there but Elsa Clark? She's got in China right enough, we so her living alone, I know. Oh, her daughter works in the Tesco's and the manager there's Alec Wilson. Remember him? <laughs> Fellow that drinks too much. Oh, everybody thought he was gay, turns out he was, isn't he? Well, he started a Saturday boy, a nice boy, Victor, bad with the acne. And he'd been in the Terry's and get pally with Norma Flynn's boy, Rab, with a funny horn like a claw. All oh, the beans called him Rab the Crab, mind. Well... His girlfriend's mother was thrown out an old tea set that her granny had left her. Well, it was perfectly good, but she didn't need it. So she needed a rab to take up to the charity shop in the precinct. The rab says to herself, hold on a minute, I don't need to come up to the tune. I'll wash that woman's man's car. I'll take it up myself. So it does. But she's no in. 
So our man takes in the tea set. Whose man took in the tea set, Isa? <laughs> Barbara's man. She's married. <laughs> oh. Have you a... Uh, I have, so, I. Uh, so Long way to get to that information. I hate gossip, but... So how many books did you get? Uh, two. What, just one each? That's not very much. Uh, any more than that, you'll be busier than I want them cabby with crabs. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get the coffee. Right, yeah. <laughs> oh, come on. Winston. You're doing in here. Anywhere else to go, sure. <laughs> You're a dab hand at that. <laughs> Aye, well, that's what a week out the clansman does for you. It's a week already. Aye. Longest week of my life. You see, this morning, I had the crossword done, taught myself chess, and wallpapered the fireplace wall before my first shite of the day. <laughs> you must have sold out the night. You know, Big Tony, you know? Well, he's steaming drunk, you know, and he's in the pub, and he's shouting and bawling. I can juggle enough. Of course, nobody believes him. So eventually, like good few of them, I said, maybe we'll buy you a drink if you can juggle right enough. So he's full of that red stuff, that gunk, that aftershock stuff, full of it. He's in the back of the barn, he's up in a stool in one leg, they're all going, Tony, Tony! Ah, you never, you never really missed yourself, it was a lot of shit. Did you see Larry Hagman and Lorraine Kelly this morning? No, I did not, no. I did, looking his age, didn't he? Is he, aye? I thought he looked after the cell now. You want to get yourself back up with that clansman fella? I see you're in with Big Boobra. Barton. <laughs> I'm still seeing Victor. Aye. No. Oh, I Gain him a wide berth since you hooked up with your fancy PC. Eh? That's poor. What's poor? Even Victor hung out to dry like that. I mean, don't get me wrong, if I was getting some hole flung at me, I'd be distracted and all, but you've got to look after your pals. Hey, 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 hey. It's not like that with me and Barbara. We're just companions. Oh, Q is murder. Hmm. Oh, hello there. It's Winston, isn't it? Hello, hen. Full house. Jamie, cow. <laughs> right, that's me. That's me off, ladies. Goodbye. Jack. Barbara. Bye. Got a clarinet lesson at two. It's all about where you put your fingers, you know. <laughs> Hello, Victor. Hello, Barbara. Cloudy the day, isn't it? Aye, cloudy. I want my pal back. <laughs> what do you mean? You know fine what I mean. You've no right being with him. You're married. Oh. Right. <clears throat> that. What do you think you're playing at, eh? Jack's been widowed ten year. You can't go tinkering with someone's feelings like that. Listen, Victor, the last thing I was going to do was hurt Jack. He's great company, and that's all there is to it. Well, what does your hubby think of that, eh? <coughs> ah. He doesn't know. Doesn't know what? Hey, doesn't know what to charge for the cardigan. <laughs> <laughs> you came in here anyway. Just bringing in Mayor Clay's. <laughs> right, Barbara. How does this in for tonight? Pepper steaks. Oh, tonight? Oh, you've got other plans. No, no. Tonight be fine. Smashing. Right. What about you, Victor, tonight? Hey. Well, I thought the three years could sit down and have a nice wee no shop, eh? Oh, no. You do your thing. I don't want to... Three's a crowd, Jack. Oh, come on now. I was always going to ask you, like. So you were. And what's for pudding? Gooseberries. <laughs> ah, well... Exhibit A. Read them and weep. Three juicy steaks. How about it? Come on. Aye, all right. Hi. Good. Oh. <laughs> this ought to be fun. Is there sugar in this, Jack? Oh, aye, right, there will be. Say, Barbara takes sugar in her tea. Sorry, sorry. <clears throat> So I went on. Why? He's still barred at the clansman. Really? You're off a quiet. No reason. You in the huff because of me and Barbara? No, it's it's not that. Well, what is it then? 
I've something to tell you, Jack. I'm your pal, and you need to know. So do. Nine one three five. Oh, hello, Barbara. Yes. Oh, where are you? Oh, how? How do I see? No, not at all. No. Well, I'll see you. All right. Oh. No, that's that's not at all. No, 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 not at all. Well, uh, look after yourself then, Barbara. And all the best. Yes. <coughs> yes, you too. Bye now. That was Barbara. Aye. So not becoming. No. Said she's a. Uh... I know. I'm sorry, Jack. That's all right, Victor. That's all right. A rare oh, meal, like Jack it. boy. Right, right. I am stuffed. Uh, me and home is full of the work here. <laughs> <laughs> right. to see you two pally again. Winston. <laughs> cool. Blow my cover. Two pints, Bobby. Three pints. Uh, th three pints, Bobby. How the hell are you playing it? He's no winning. I'll stand here, happy as you like, eh? The perfect customer. He'll be none the wiser. And nobody's tippled. He used to, didn't he? Let's go, boys. Hey, young mate. Here, you, you dirty bastard! That's exactly what I'm on about! That pint's a bloody disgrace! I mean that would bring you out your daft old tit. Watch me! I knew I'd get you in jail, don't you? Oh my goodness. It's good to be loving. <laughs> <laughs> I've missed that place. Oh, my head. What a night. Oh. I'll just take another wee half hour. I cannot, I'm, the C, are, I haven't looked into this, are all of the seasons of this show, like, six episodes long, because I was looking at my season one, and I was, there's only, like, two left after this, so, are they all that short, or are there longer ones? I also see some, like, specials involved in some of this, so I don't know where the timeline works with that, but... <laughs> I'm definitely going to be watching it all, as well as trying to get some of the comedy reactions in as well. I know I've just been doing Still Game recently. I do want to do the comedy reactions as well. Just the last, like, two that I tried to do ended up getting blocked. And I know that other people do them, so I know that it's available to do, but I might just have to cut it up more. So but keep those suggestions coming. I'm going to be looking into everything that I can watching everything that I can as much as time allows, okay? And the more you subscribe, the more that I'll dedicate time to this. So keep the subscriptions coming. 
thank you for everyone that has subscribed. I do appreciate it. I've seen the massive rise in my subscriber count, and I do appreciate it. I think I doubled in the last couple months what I had had from the past two years. So I'm aware. I'm thankful. But I also see how many people are watching, and I know we could do better.